catalogs I've been getting. I've been looking through them, finding all sorts of interesting new vegetable varieties that I think you'll be interested in. I've assembled a slideshow, so take a look, see what you think. Astro arugula is slower bolting, more cold tolerant, has a milder flavor, and you can start picking it at 21 days. Napoleon has a compact plant with three and a half inch pods that are perfect for canning whole. Purple teepee has purple potted beans that grow above the foliage. Talk about easy picking. Trilogy is a nice mix of provider, royal burgundy, and golden rook door beans. Amarillo has yellow fillet style beans. Pride of Vermont is a compact plant with 11 inch long pods that are touted for being tender and having a nutty flavor. Blauhilda is a German heirloom with huge purple pods that are tender and stringless no matter how large the pods get and their rosy flowers look pretty in the garden. Rich purple pod is crunchy and easy to pick because of their color. Mammoth cannellini, that is an organic pole bean that you dry for soups and bean dishes. Cranberry is an organic pole bean as well that has a beautiful color. Robin Hood is an English variety that produces early and needs no support. I chose albino because of its unusual color. It won't stain your fingers or your countertops. Touchstone Gold is an organic beet with golden flesh and a sweet flavor. Isn't this a beauty? Batavia is an early variety with a sweet, nutty flavor. Di Chico is an Italian heirloom from the late 1800s with a longer harvesting time. Integro is an organic, compact cabbage with medium heads and beautiful purple leaves. Look at this beautiful European cabbage. Calibos has heads that weigh about two pounds each and have deep red leaves. Oxheart is an heirloom variety of stout carrots that grow to six inches long. K2 is a very sweet corn with beautifully colored kernels. Hoffman's Johanna is a European slicing variety with a mild, non-bitter taste. Mexican sour gherkins are beautifully marked like miniature watermelons and they have a slightly citrusy flavor. They are also available at Cook's Garden, Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds, and Pine Tree Garden Seeds. Pitch Siam is one of the smallest eggplant varieties, harvested at just two to three inches. Look how pretty the fruits are. Apple green is good for regions with cooler, shorter growing seasons and has edible skins. Early black egg has deep purple fruits, leaves, and stems and originates from Japan. Patio Baby is an All-America selection with compact plants and three-inch eggplants. It's also available from Territorial Seed. Renee's Special Baby Leaf Blend is a beautiful salad mix. Look at those colors. Thuranus is too beautiful to pass up. It's a dark red romaine with full-size heads. Trucus is another beauty that is a romaine-type lettuce that will melt in your mouth. It's also available at Johnny's Seeds. Tuscan Baby Leaf has a tender, milder flavor and you can start harvesting it in 25 days. Scarlet kale is a pretty red kale that caught my eye. Bandit is a cold hardy variety that has quite thick stems that can be harvested in about 120 days. Zermatt is a shorter season variety that matures in just 85 days. Snow Leopard is a beauty that will grow in Inland Northwest Gardens because it matures in just 71 days. The white flesh is sweet. 
El Gordo can grow up to an amazing 20 pounds, yet the melons mature in 75 to 85 days. Red Hawk caught my eye because it's a long day variety, which is ideal for northern gardens. I love the deep red color. Gladiator is an English parsnip with very smooth skin. Pretty Pleasin doesn't require trellising and it holds the pea pods at the tops of the plants for easy picking. This is Golden Sweet with its golden snow peas and purple flowers, what's not to like? It's also available from Territorial Seed, Cook's Garden, and Baker Creek Heirloom Seeds. Cayenetta is an All-America selection that is well suited for growing in containers. This is Kookaburra spinach. With a name that's fun to say, this spinach can be harvested as baby leaves in just 27 days or mature leaves in 37. Unique Hybrid is a small spaghetti squash with a nutty flavor that matures in 85 days. Little Bites Cherry is a container variety with compact plants. The tomatoes ripen in 65 days. Ketchup and Fries is a grafted tomato and potato plant that I wrote about on my blog. Be sure to check it out. This would be fun to try, don't you think? Mm -hmm.